What's going on guys? So we're gonna do a different type of port today. All these have no silicone. The only one that has silicone is titanium white. We have a magenta, crimson. This is a cerulean blue and then thalo blue. I'm going to layer the reds in one cup, the blues in another cup, and do like a red, white, blue pour. So let me get these empty cups over here. Move this titanium white off to the side. How's everybody doing today? I hope everybody's doing great. Let me try something weird. I don't know what this is gonna do, but we're gonna see. <laughs> Maybe it'll do some crazy layering of the cup. I don't know. So there's no silicone in these. There's that. All right. Yeah, it did layer it kind of, kind of funky. And then we'll do the same thing with the cool colors. <clears throat> I like to play around, experiment, and try things that I don't know what they're gonna do. So. Trying to get as much of this out as possible. Nice. All right, so we have both of our cups layered in a spiral pattern. Pretty cool. And then we have the white. So I wanted to start with the red, but since there's blue here already, it's gonna be kind of a straight pour. Sort of. That does look kind of wicked. The way it layered those colors. I think it's pretty cool. And then let's get this blue. Huh? Yeah, it did some really cool stuff to the colors for sure like that and then we got our white I just want to have the white going down the center it's not layered in any specific way it just has silicone in it so the white should be what gives us the cells all right so there's still some white left over let me see if I can kind of spread this just a little bit. Man, that's pretty wicked looking. All right, let's... Got our little whirly gig here. And I'm just gonna... Kind of... Make lines. Wipe this off. I want the blue to be more in there. I am really not trying to drip, but I could clean that out with a cells. Kind of cool looking. Nice. I know I'm still going to have to stretch this just a little bit. All right. So that's the, the blue. I do want to turn it over get to this red section. Make sure I've cleaned that off well enough. I 
Yeah, that's doing some really crazy stuff right there. It's almost like it hit like a large patch of silicone or something. spin it but we're just gonna do a light little spin I don't want to lose a lot of the blues and reds well that came out interesting so I'm gonna try to get just a little bit more out of the cup cover these corners. And there we go. Now to make the silicone react. Yeah, that's really cool looking. Just watching those cells come out is so cool. There's that. Yeah, that's really cool. I like that. Because it has those really sharp lines, but then it also has cells too. And it did that in the red and the blue. That's so cool. There we go. All right. Oh, I actually do. I like this one a lot. I wasn't sure if I was going to like it or not. But let me bring you guys down. I want you guys to see it. And all these really tiny cells. But then you also have the really sharp, defined reds. And moving over towards the blue. I really like the look of kind of the straight bore and the cells together. Looks like little red and blue tentacles or something. What do you see? If you want to watch another video just like this, click the screen right now and I'll see you there.